In December 2017, the Byron Bay Solar Train made its first kilometer round trip between the town of Byron Bay and North Beach, making it the world's first solar powered train. The Byron Bay Railroad Company searched the country and found a dilapidated vintage train called a Red Rattler and spent $4 million to restore it and get it up and running, including another $1.8 million on restoring the 3 km disused rail line. Plus a further $1 million was spent on the train shed and two platforms at each end. The two carriage rail set was constructed in Sydney in 1949 using aluminium, which made them very lightweight. On its roof, the train boasts 6 kilowatts of custom made flexible solar panels and are backed up by 77 kilowatt hours of battery storage, which has taken the place of one of the train's two original diesel engines. The train only uses about 4 kilowatt hours for each one way trip and has been able to make 16 trips and only use 25% of its onboard battery power, all without using any top up charging. The train can also recharge while stopped at each station, which are also equipped with solar panels on the roofs. The large solar array on the platform roofs, coupled with the custom curved solar panels on the train roofs, produce more solar energy per day than is required to operate an hourly return service. It is now running an hourly service that can ferry up to 100 people at a time, plus their surfboards and luggage, from 10am to 5pm 6 days a week, and costs $3 one way for a 3 km trip, which takes about 7 minutes. While building the world's first solar train is an impressive achievement, there are currently no plans to extend the service further, mostly due to the prohibitive costs of restoring the tracks. That being said, this is not a test train or a trial run. This old train was restored and converted to solar power by a multi-millionaire businessman who owns a resort in the area. Ryan said in an interview, hopefully it attracts people to Byron Bay. I think the international tourists will come here to have a look at the world's first solar train. In five years time, they'll probably still say I'm mad. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.